Hi guys, this is my first YouTube video ever and today we're unboxing the Louis Vuitton Soufflo BB. Now, I don't post videos, I never had, this is my first one and I'm not really that big into designer bags, like luxury bags, I've had about maybe five in my life. But this one's important to me, my husband picked it out, well, he picked it up for me yesterday. I picked it out but I have never seen it in person and I've searched the web and for this color combination and videos, I also want to know the sizes and I saw lots of videos on the sizes, but nothing in this color. So I thought I'd post the video so everyone else can see this color combo. And uh, I hope I love it as much as I've seen it and fell in love with it online. <laughs> I hope so. Okay, wow. Okay, I took a break to grab my only other Louis Vuitton and that's in the Tulum PM just because I wanted something about this size. So this one seems too small online at, in some pictures and then, the, and then seemed too big in other pictures. Oh boy. So I hope the sizing is right. Again, that was my reference to what I wanted. I'm, I'm nervous. <laughs> Listen, I've never been that into bags before, but the second that I saw this one, he says, my husband says it's a 13th year anniversary, you pick out a bag, get something nice. So I started looking online and I was interested in some YSL bags, but when I saw this one, I just really had to have it. And my best friend gave me the, you know, the thumbs up on this one. After of all the bags I've showed her, she liked this one the most. Oh my God, I feel it. <laughs> I'm nervous because what if I don't like it? Okay. Oh, it's darling. Oh, that's perfect for me. Yes, that's a good size. This is exactly what I was wanting. It... Okay, so here's the color and this is the whole point, you guys. So it's blue suede inside. I hope you guys can see that. Blue suede and it's got this red trim on it and the black logo. It's very edgy and more me instead of the canvas, um, this is called Bacchetta, yes. Oh, speaking of that, um, my next video I'll probably make is replacing all the leather on this because for some reason this um, patina is a little darker, just this one handle. So I'm gonna do a video showing making that bag brand new again. Okay, so back to this little BB, Soufflo BB. Oh, it's at the silk. These are pretty big feet, big silver feet. All right, I'm hoping I can fit all my needs in here. Oh, strap. I've never used a strap before, but I'm gonna try it on and show it what it looks like on me against my body. I'm 5'5", 135. I know people like to talk about these things, but this is not the point of my video. The point was just about the coloring. Okay, so I'm gonna connect this. Try to be quick about it. I don't know if there's a right way to do this or not. Okay, so this is the front. Oh, here, this, this will help. I'm all clumsy and nervous. <laughs> okay. Oh, well, this looks pretty right at the hip. And this is the hook. This is probably how I'll most likely use it. And then what else is there? It's crossbody. It's, it's a little short right now to do crossbody. Actually, it works. Okay. And this is a good height to... to Look in, grab what I need. Okay, so I'm happy. I'm in love with it. My husband will be glad I like it, especially with this price tag. If you're interested in a bag like that, like this, that's structured, this is my first structured bag. Um, I, they, I usually like them floppy, but um, if this isn't in your budget, a good um, substitute would be the Kate Spade Margot. Um, it's pretty similar, but not a luxury brand. Okay, so I've been carrying this little bag around just as a Kate Spade bag. You can really beat the piss out of these things. So here we go. It's a wallet. 
um it's COVID time, you guys. That's the reason why I never saw this bag in person is because I haven't been getting out because of that whole situation. We need these, They're very important. Sunglasses. Another pack, just in case. <laughs> I have three kids, so. Kleenex, medication. I still have some room in here for a toiletry bag. And yeah, and that's about it. So this is perfect size for me for my everyday use. I'm glad I went with this. I didn't want a big clunky bag. So, all right, hopefully you guys liked the video that it was showed the bag enough and you guys got a good idea of what this bag looks like in this color and in this size. Thanks for checking it out in my video. And uh, like I said, I'll be posting another video soonish, as soon as I drop off my other uh, Tulum PM and get it refaced. Thanks guys.